Hi everyone, how are you today? I hope you are always healthy. Welcome back to my channel. Like always, today I'm going to show you 15 amazing photos that will make you wonder about the advanced technology of the past. Some might say that I'm being repetitive by displaying these photos. But that's the whole point. These photos are proof that a small occult elite of erased and re the history to fit their narrative. So, without further ado, fasten your pants and let's get started. A lot of old stamps, mainly from what is now Russia. Look at those pyramids behind the duck. So much more going on just from looking at these stamps. Ancient houses found after the collapse of the street in Iran. Mud flood evidence is clear. The Castle of Coca is a castle located in the Coca municipality central Spain. The castle was constructed in the 15th century and has been considered to be one of the best examples of Spanish brickwork. Inchen Pagoda Forest, Changping, Beijing, China. The Silver Mountain Pagoda Forest, a cultural heritage site, is a sacred place of Buddhism. In the early Tang Dynasty, 618 to 907, the Avatamasaka Temple with more than 70 rooms was built here. The fragrance of incense was always in the air. Its popularity is evidenced by another saying that there were 72 temples, 72 pagodas, 72 wells, 72 stone rollers, and 72 stone mills on Yinshan Mountain. Unfortunately, the celebrated temple was ruined during the War of Resistance against Japan in the 1930-1940s. The main pagoda with its many structures is where the splendor of the Buddha temple used to be. The five multi-eve pagodas built in the Jin dynasty represent the largest and best preserved of their kind in China. Such a group of Jin dynasty pagodas can only be found on Yinshan Mountain, and many of the most famous Buddhist masters in China are also buried here. The five pagodas are among the 100 still existing ones built over 800 years ago. Do you still believe that little primitive men, who could not read or write, built such a building, with incomparable architecture and a finish, that today we cannot do it again? The caption says, in 1533, in October, flying dragons were seen in Bohemia and Vatland, as well as in the small area of Asher Czech Republic, a crest on their heads, a pig snout and two wings. This then went on for several days, with over 400 of them, large and small, flying together, as is pictured here. The caption says, in 1496 AD, in the month of January, at the time the Tiber burst its high and wide banks near Rome, a strange creature was found dead after the fury and power of the Tiber waters had subsided and was in this form, as per the painting of the picture. Pay attention to the roof of the building on the left. Do you really think that it was an artist's imagination? Before I continue the video, please give a like if you'd learned something, 
And, don't forget to subscribe, and also, click the notification bell too, so you won't miss any update. And, watch to the end, to avoid misunderstanding. Thank you. eighteen ninety three chicago world's fair the picture says more than a thousand words welcome to the show yeah we build all of these giant buildings but we had not enough time to make a freaking road to that colossal thing over there in nineteen thirty one huge sized skeletons were found in humboldt lake bed in lovelock nevada they measured 8.5 and 10 feet respectively, which is huge, and the skeletons were wrapped in a fabric. In the year 1969, in the Lima, Peru Museum, giant bones were found and photographed by Glenn Kimball. As described by Kimball, the gloves of the mummies had finger of 10 inches, and the crown of the mummies could be worn around Kimball's waist. There is so much evidence to prove that giants exist. This is just a small example of the discoveries of giant bones and skeletons. They hide these discoveries of giants to hide the true history, then bring fake theories of dinosaurs and fake bones as true history. 1. While excavating in the Khao Kanap Nam cave in Thailand, an archaeological team unearthed a skeleton of a being, who was most likely a male, and measured 5 or possibly 6 meters, or 16 to 19 feet. Next to the skeletons were the remains of a giant serpent. Sacsayhuaman, in Peru. The archaeological site of Sacsayhuaman, located on a high hill above Cusco, is characterized by colossal stone pieces. To me, it looks like they had fun building this, I don't believe hard labor was the reason for getting impossibly tight joints and nicely rounded andesite blocks. It doesn't look like a chore, more like they enjoyed showing their work off. Some of these blocks weigh over a hundred tons. New York Palace in Budapest The official year of construction is claimed to be 1894. Of course, as per usual with every other old world structure claimed to have been built recently, there is not a single photograph of the construction. The controllers simply need to change a number in the archives, and the whole history of a building has been rewritten that easily. What technologies could have allowed such powerful lighting in the 19th century? Some of the petrified giant tree stump mountains are one kilometer in diameter or more. With an average ration of 1 to 30 width of trunk to height of tree, a one kilometer diameter would make the tree 30 kilometers high. That's where the jumbo jets fly. Many would have been twice as high. Now, imagine what the forest floor must have looked like, filled with leaves, twigs, fruits, tree sap and more. Get ready for a new look at geology. Everything we've been told is a lie. Adjust your thinking, open your mind to all possibilities, and start to live. Comment below with more topic ideas for me to discuss. As a lot of care and hard work goes into this, likes and subscribe, let me know I'm doing a good job. All is appreciated greatly. You may not agree with everything from the content I post. Apply critical thinking and use discernment to come to your own conclusions regarding the content. Thanks for watching this video. This Everything Inside Me channel, see you on the next video. Stay safe and healthy.